What data was used to train Sora? We used publicly available data and licensed data. Sora is one announcement that still has the AI industry reeling. The demos of Sora's capabilities from OpenAI were both stunning and shocking, defying everything we thought we knew about AI. My belief is that all repetitive human work, that will all be done in the next couple of decades, better, cheaper, faster by AI. It was as if Sora had come from another world, one where AI had already surpassed human intelligence. But right now, Sora is about to get a lot more interesting. New videos from Sora. Over the past month, several filmmakers have embarked on an experimental journey with Sora. The outcomes of these experiments, as posted by those who tried it out, have proven to be nothing short of astonishing. The first video is an airhead that was generated by Shy Kids. From what we can see, the film's scenes are so realistic that you might mistake them for live action if it weren't for the quirky character with a balloon for a head. One issue with our current generative video tools is maintaining consistency across frames. They often struggle with intricate anatomical details such as hands and faces. However, in Airhead, there's a striking scene featuring a train car filled with passengers, and the faces are incredibly lifelike. Then there's a second video titled Abstract, and it's by Paul Trillo. Trillo confirmed that all visuals were directly from Sora with no color correction or post effects applied. The jump cut edits in the film's first part were also generated using this technology. Trillo explained that he was inspired to explore beyond the gaming-like aesthetic seen in OpenAI's recent demos. He sought to discover different visual styles achievable with Sora. The outcome is a video resembling vintage 16mm film achieved through a series of experimental prompts. The last one is titled Beyond Our Reality by Don Allen Stevenson. Don Allen Stevenson mentions that Sora interprets prompts quite literally. For instance, when he attempted to zoom in on a helicopter, Sora fused the helicopter with a camera's zoom lens in a unique interpretation. Despite this, Stevenson finds Sora easier to guide creatively compared to previous models, relishing the unpredictability of the process. The current state of video creation. It's going to be net great, but it's going to be like a technological revolution. It's going to be a societal revolution. You see, the world of video creation is in an exciting and evolving state right now. Thanks to advancements in technology, Creating videos has become more accessible to everyone, not just professionals. Many people use smartphones with high-quality cameras, and simple editing software is available on computers or even directly on mobile devices. One big change is the rise of social media platforms like TikTok, Instagram, and YouTube, where short-form videos are hugely popular. This trend has fueled creativity and encouraged people to experiment with different styles and content. As a result, the variety of videos being made today is incredibly diverse, ranging from educational tutorials and cooking demonstrations to comedy sketches and personal vlogs. However, along with these positive developments, there are challenges and flaws in the current state of video creation. If this technology goes wrong, we want to be vocal about that. We want to work with the government to prevent that from happening. One challenge is the overwhelming amount of content being produced. With so many videos uploaded every minute, it can be hard for individual creators to stand out and reach a wide audience. This saturation of content also makes it difficult for viewers to find high quality and original videos amidst the noise. Another challenge is the pressure to constantly produce new content. Many creators feel the need to keep up with trends and post regularly to maintain their audience's interest. This can lead to burnout and affect the quality of the videos being produced. Additionally, not everyone has access to the necessary resources or skills to create polished videos. While technology has made video creation more accessible, there is still a learning curve involved in mastering editing techniques and storytelling. But with the coming of Video Creation 2.0, we are about to experience a whole new level of creativity. I know your next question. What is Video Creation 2.0? Video Creation 2.0 represents a cutting-edge evolution in how videos are made, enabled by the integration of artificial intelligence. Traditional video creation, as we all know, involves manual processes like filming, editing, and adding effects, which could be time-consuming and require specialized skills. However, with Video Creation 2.0, AI-driven technologies are revolutionizing this landscape. One key challenge with traditional video production was its complexity and cost. Video Creation 2.0 simplifies this by automating many tasks through AI. For instance, 
AI can assist in generating and editing video content much faster than human efforts alone. Sora, as an AI-driven tool, plays a vital role in this transformation. Imagine being able to create professional quality videos with minimal effort. When I say minimal effort, all you have to do is craft out the perfect prompt and throw it in and it brings out a perfect video. AI-powered tools like Sora generate the best videos one could never have imagined, just like the ones we saw at the beginning of this video. It is capable of cutting and arranging scenes, suggesting transitions, and even adjusting colors and lighting. This level of automation reduces the need for extensive manual editing, saving time and resources. Another aspect where Video Creation 2.0 excels is customization. AI can tailor videos to specific audiences or platforms. For example, Sora can optimize videos for various social media channels, ensuring they meet the requirements of each platform effortlessly. Most importantly, AI is improving the quality of video content. Sora and similar tools can enhance video resolution, remove background noise, and even generate realistic special effects. This means creators can focus more on storytelling and less on technical details. The implications of video creation 2.0 hit even harder. How the industry will change forever. Firstly, the equalization of video creation will be a game changer. With AI tools like Sora, anyone, regardless of technical expertise, can produce high quality videos. This shift lowers barriers to entry, allowing more individuals and businesses to leverage video content for marketing, storytelling, education, and entertainment purposes. As a result, we can expect to see a surge in diverse, creative video content from a broader range of creators. Secondly, Video Creation 2.0 will optimize efficiency and reduce costs. AI-driven automation streamlines labor-intensive tasks like editing, thereby saving time and resources. This efficiency boost enables faster production cycles and more agile content creation strategies. Businesses can leverage AI tools like Sora to create engaging videos at scale, reaching wider audiences without significant overhead. Furthermore, AI-enhanced video production improves content quality. Sora and similar technologies can enhance visuals, optimize audio, and suggest creative elements, resulting in polished, professional-looking videos. This enhancement in quality will raise the overall standard of video content across various platforms. Lastly, Video Creation 2.0 opens new avenues for personalization. AI algorithms can analyze audience preferences and behavior, enabling creators to tailor videos to specific demographics or individual viewers. This personalized approach enhances audience engagement and increases the effectiveness of video marketing campaigns. Yet alongside these opportunities come significant questions and fears, the dangers of realistic AI videos. One prominent concern is the potential for misinformation and deception. AI-generated videos, known as deep fakes, can convincingly depict individuals saying or doing things they never actually did. This capability raises serious implications for trust and authenticity in media and can be exploited for malicious purposes, such as spreading fake news, manipulating public opinion, or defaming individuals. Another danger is the erosion of trust and credibility. As deep fake technology improves, distinguishing between real and AI-generated content becomes increasingly difficult. This could lead to widespread skepticism and lack of trust in the media, undermining the credibility of legitimate sources and fostering an atmosphere of uncertainty. Furthermore, deep fakes have the potential to invade privacy and exploit individuals. By superimposing faces onto adult content or other compromising situations, AI-generated videos can be used for revenge porn or harassment, causing significant harm to the victims. This highlights the importance of robust regulations and safeguards to protect individuals from such abuses. Additionally, AI-generated videos can worsen existing social and political tensions. They can be used to fabricate incendiary content, deepen divisions, or incite violence leading to destabilization and conflict within societies. Moreover, the spread of deepfakes poses challenges for law enforcement and the justice system. Authenticating evidence becomes more complex when video footage can be easily manipulated, potentially undermining the integrity of investigations and court proceedings. The most disturbing of all these fears is the advancement risk of job displacement across various industries. With the way AI is becoming more proficient at tasks traditionally performed by humans, 
certain roles within the media and entertainment sectors may become redundant. For instance, video editing and special effects, which currently require skilled human operators, could be automated by AI tools like Sora. This automation could lead to a decrease in demand for human editors and visual effects artists. Moreover, as AI-generated videos become more sophisticated and widely adopted, industries reliant on video production, such as advertising, marketing, and media production, may see a shift in labor dynamics. Jobs involved in creating and editing video content may be at risk of being replaced by AI systems capable of producing comparable results more efficiently. While we have acknowledged that this breakthrough has the potential to streamline processes and reduce costs for businesses, the downside is the potential loss of employment for individuals in these sectors. Addressing these challenges will require proactive measures, such as upskilling workers for roles that complement AI technology, fostering innovation-driven job creation, and implementing policies to support workers affected by automation-induced job displacement. By taking these steps, Societies can navigate the transition towards AI-driven technologies while minimizing adverse impacts on employment. Also, we should view this collaboration as more than just a means to enhance video creation efficiency. Instead, we should explore how humans and machines can combine their strengths to craft engaging and imaginative narratives that captivate audiences in novel ways. This goes a long way to show the rapid progress we are making in the field of artificial intelligence because at the end of the day, it is still humans who are driving these breakthroughs. If you have made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.